You know, and then like if you uh, go on YouTube, like we also got rap battles. He also rap battle. That's one thing okay. I just want to bring up. You know, yeah. he done he rap battle for Southern Slang Battle League, and he rap battle with the same league I battle for, Iron Mount Battle League. You okay. Know? Shout out yeah, shout out MDL for Dutch. sure. AC Dutch. You know? That's yeah, dope, that's man. Awesome. Shout out to Dutch. Dutch got Dutch land popping right man. now. I love it. I love it. So, hey, so I ain't know you got back into battling, man. So you back battling? No, or he, what? he, he no, did he a battle. Me. Okay, yeah, okay, I got you. I got you. Okay. But I want to. Don't get me wrong. You know, Sarah, somebody, man. Yeah, I battle. I'm itching, man. I'm itching, you know. I just want to say I battled Chef Trez before he was Chef Trez. So uh oh. Like, yeah. Okay. So, okay. Like, people don't know that because we used to have these uh, these battle rap lines on the phone. Yeah. If y'all familiar with Big Cannon from the Wild. Okay. Um, he was actually um, allowing some of us small time people, you know what I'm saying, a little bit of, you know, some battling, you know. I guess it was a community. If you yeah. Know. And um, with that, man, there was just so much going on. Like, I just kind of fell in love with it. And I started joining other leagues and started doing it in person and started doing, like, all types of battle rap material. But it kind of, what the thing is with, with the battle rap is that it kind of tears you into um, in, in the two, in a way, because you have on one side, you're a studio artist and you know that, and then you're a battle rapper, but they're two different avenues or right. two different type of things and, and, and I felt like you know it was kind of hard for me to um, I don't know kind of get into it and get out of it yeah and, and change up my style yeah because then I started doing tracks where I felt like I was battling somebody yeah. and people yeah. were like man why are yeah. you rapping at us like that <laughs> yeah you're supposed to be yeah. talking about turning up you're right. talking about you're gonna grab the <laughs> right 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 I feel you, <laughs> you I feel you yeah it's hard but, it, but I love it, you know, and here we are, you know what I'm saying? I ain't battling no more. I'm going to tell you all right now, I don't battle no more. Okay. And, and, and the reason I don't battle no more, and, and it's no disrespect to anybody, anyone that I've ever, you know, battled with, it's just that I'm getting to a point where I no longer like the politics involved in it, and I no longer like doing it as a sport. Yeah. I'd rather judge it. Please, if you want me to be at a battle rap event, I will judge it, because yeah. I know the criteria, but yeah. I'm not going to battle. I'll battle again if the money's right and the opponent too. You know, I, I don't want to. That's it, man. That's yeah. it. I'll do it one more time for 2020. You know, I ain't done it in five years, but I'll do it. I feel like I got it in me still. You know, and I know I do, man. Maybe that's if they pay me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe if they pay me. <laughs> I didn't think about that. Personally. <laughs> <laughs> you might pay me. <laughs> that's dope that's dope and one thing i do like about battle rapping is you know like you say the sport the the aggression of it you know and i like the part how you say it's two different people like yeah. it's hard to be that studio artist where you're trying to make a single you're yeah. trying to make a club banger you're trying to make something the ladies can dance to and right. you talking about you know it's it's aggressive, you know, it can get aggressive, you know, it's almost like acting almost, you know, it's like you get so deep into this character and then you have to pull yourself out of it and be who you really are, you know what I'm saying, battling is the same way as far as the aspect of getting back to being a studio artist, you know, recording artist, so I definitely like that you spoke on that, a lot of people don't speak on that, you know. Yeah, they're afraid, man, they can't do it, right. you know, they can't move, it is what it is, man, I, I don't blame them, you know what I'm saying, because there's like full fledged battle rappers that are the best battle rappers, but they can't make a song. You know exactly. And then there's exactly. People, and there's people like in the mainstream that he are just opened a can of worms, yeah. baby. Yeah, oh. baby. We gotta talk about it. Yeah. We gotta oh talk about God. it because and, and and it's so funny that you mentioned like URL. Like I've watched a lot of the smack battles, and I see these guys, and I'm like, man, they're dope. Like they yeah. are devastating yeah. on the mic on the stage, but. When I hear the actual projects, I'm like, nah, nah homie, that ain't it. It depends, it. It depends on who it is. Like man. Cassidy, you know, he oh, yeah, 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 you know, yeah, right, 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 yeah. Some people are more battle rappers than they are studio artists, but I gotta give a shout out to Cortez, man. And yeah. You know what I'm saying? I gotta give a shout out to Daylight because you know what I'm saying? Man, Daylight's a huge inspiration Daylight. of mine. Wow, yeah. And, and he could do both, man. He can do poetry, he can yeah. do spoken word, he can do uh -huh. theatrics. The man show up in a Batman costume, yeah, yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? Do a backflip off the stage, yeah. but naked after. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's hey, and he can hoop. Shout out to the homie Daylight. I had him on the show a couple years back. Real dope artist, man, down to earth. And like after the interview over, he was like, "Hey, man, take down my number." I'm like, "Huh? Wait a minute, you?" He's like, "No." You, you never know You might need me for something I might need you for something Take down my number And I was like Okay cool Like he's really You know Real down to earth guy man Like I said He dunking on people Like you know what I mean Like you wouldn't believe But uh Yeah I, I think it It is that definitely Um divide where you get those artists who can make you know hit records but like i say a lot of them they just stuck on that shelf the battle rap shelf you know and like i say i watch them man summer madness all this stuff and i'd be like man what what are you know right. i i see that 
that intensity, I see that talent, but then when it comes to that mixtape or that EP or that single, and I'm that like, album. I'm yeah. like, nah, homie, I'm yeah. like, nah, you know what I'm saying?